We have officially reset Woodsboro. We are here with Timmy and Tommy getting ready to pick a new island. Let's get into it. So first off, I created my character, you know, made her all nice and cute. And then we were given a couple of options to pick our new map. We went with the Northern Hemisphere per the usual because that's where, you know, that's where I am. I was tempted, I was almost tempted to go with Southern Hemisphere here because I've never, I've never done something opposite before, but I figured let's keep it simple and stick with our regular time zone. So I went ahead and I picked this bottom right hand corner map because I liked how far away Resident Services was. After I picked that map, we hopped on in and we met our starter villagers. Uh, we got apples for our fruit, but I'm not really worried about that. We got Biff and Pashmina. Not bad. Not great, but you know, is what it is. I went ahead and grabbed my tent from Tommy and I wandered to the beach and put it down on the beach because that just makes it easier. I then grabbed um, Pashmina's tent from her and I let her know that I would place it down in the most perfect spot available. Spoiler alert, it's going to be on the beach. Um, I did the same with Biff. I took his and I ran back over to where my tent was and I plopped down Pashmina's and then I plopped down Biff's and we were all good to go. Next up, I started working on paying off that ridiculous loan. Um, some of the easiest ways that I go about this is I, um, I edit my passport, I take a photo, I change the flag when Isabel shows up. Um, right now I'm just picking a different um, tagline, I believe is what it's called. And then here is another easy way to get some Nook Miles. Um, just post on the bulletin board. I always just post a little card that says hi. Super simple and you get Nook Miles for it. See, 300 nook miles right there. And then taking the photo, you get 300 nook miles there. I randomly just make a design because that also gives you easy nook miles. I delete this design later when I'm picking out codes for the island. So 500 nook miles for that. Nook miles for selling weeds. That one is super easy because you have to clean up anyways. Spending bells with Timmy and Tommy, easy way to get Nook Miles. Selling stuff, easy way to get Nook Miles. So after that, I decided to take some time and put down Blather's tent because getting Blather's here is kind of a big deal, sort of, kind of. It's one of it's one of the things to get to three stars. So we got his tent put down, We're super happy for that. Back on the grind, we gotta get rid of that debt, right? So 300 there, 300 for some trash tools, I believe it is, yep, 300. And then spending bells, again, we got more Nook Miles for that. I did plant some flowers and then I watered those flowers and got more Nook Miles for that. Finally, I came in here to tell Tom Nook, my dues are paid. Don't bug me ever again. Take me off your call list. 5,000 miles paid. After that, Timmy was, he, he was, he was like, you, you've got this. Uh, we need a shop. So I went, I got everything needed for his shop. I placed it down and then I let him know, hey, your shop's ready to go. After that, uh, Tom Nook wanted me to place some houses down for new villagers to come in, so we plopped them down. And of course we got Al that moved in. Um, not great. N not great. After that, I decided to do some random horrible decorating. This will be picked up later on because once I, once we get KK here, 
we're just gonna flatten the island and completely start over so I'm not worried about what I'm actually putting down we got the campsite down and we got Olaf um, so we started running it with Isabel we were like come on one star and she just broke my heart with two stars and she broke my heart again with two stars <laughs> but finally we got those three stars we okay guys so we officially have three stars on our island i just wanted to go over a couple of points here so that it was easy to compile it all into one i guess planting the not native fruit that you receive in the mail so there there should be three of them plant those three ten bushes is what I placed down. Um, I didn't put them anywhere nice. I put them all together. I just plopped them down. Um, 10 flowers. After that, I got five farm crops. Carrots, tomatoes, wheat, and potatoes. And I, I planted uh, four of each of them, but you only need five crops. After that, if you just take the fencing that Tom Nook gives you and put it down, that should be good enough for three stars. After that was just decoration items. So about 15 Nook Mile items, about 13 Nook Shopping items, and about 15 DIY items. That is all you need to get to three stars. It's really easy once you get it down. To Before that though, you wanna make sure that you have eight villagers, Blathers, Nook's Cranny, and Abel Sisters. Got Mabel, I bought her out two times in a row and then the third time she showed up she let me know that she was moving in the listed items here on the left hand side of the screen that's all you need for three stars i hope this video helped you guys did enjoy it make sure to like comment and subscribe come join the cozy verse which is a link is located below in the description have the loveliest of days and i will see you all in the next video bye for now